Hey guys, what is going on? It is the Crypto Kid, and in this video, I'm gonna be talking about Zcash. Now, I'm gonna be giving my Zcash coin price prediction 2018, also a brief explanation of what is Zcash, and I'm gonna give me giving you my opinion on will Zcash be added to Coinbase. Now, a lot of people are saying, if it's added to Coinbase, will Zcash moon, right? Um, or what's what's the price going to be, which is why I kind of try to answer it um, in both terms, in, in, in the scenario where it is added to Coinbase and the scenario where it isn't. However, guys, I do want to point out that I am um, not too bullish on it being added to Coinbase for a couple of reasons, and I'll get into that um, later on this video. So now, before anything, guys, please subscribe to my channel, turn on those post notifications, like this video if you do like it, and uh, follow my social media as, as at, that helps um, me out a lot, guys. And you can just be um, in the mix for giveaways, news, uh, updates on my channel, and all kinds of awesome stuff, guys. So stay tuned for that. And yeah, let's get right into this. Now, Zcash is currently $216. It's down 1% today. Market cap of $963 million. Uh, circulating supply of 4.4 million, so very small supply. However, the total supply, um, it's not known, but they have said it is um, the exact same supply as Bitcoin because um, Zcash is actually a fork of on uh, the Bitcoin protocol. So uh, volume is way too high, guys. This is actually, this volume is fake, I do have to say. Like, if you go on the markets, you can see that L Bank, like not exchange, no one really knows, is apparently doing 54 million in volume in the last 24 hours. That's just fake. It's fake volume. Um, um, yeah, it's just fake volume, really, because the coins you can see, it's not, not even affected the price in negative or positive way. So that is fake volume. But Charles, it's reaching all time high of $876 around January, beginning of January 2018, as most coins did, right, uh, reach the all-time highs. It's ranked 20th um, based on market cap. Um, if we go over to the website, guys, so essentially Zcash is, it's just a fork of Bitcoin, right? It's a fork on the Bitcoin protocol, and it is a privacy coin, um, similar to Monero, but it is it is different than Monero. Um, I, I think I prefer Monero more. If you're really going to go for a privacy coin, I think Monero is the is just so private. However, Monero will never be listed to Coinbase. And the fact that Coinbase said they might they were interested in Zcash is um is quite interesting. So Bitcoin and most crypto coins expose your entire payment history to the public. Zcash is the first open permissionless cryptocurrency that can fully protect the privacy of transactions using zero knowledge crypto cryptography. So cryptography. So zero knowledge uh, cryptography. So yes, Zcash has been around for a while, guys. They are not a new coin, which I like to see, meaning they have a team, they have a very developed technology. Um, They've been around since October 29th, 2016, so more than most coins have been around, and that is a good sign that because since that means they're proven, right? Their tech, their tech and their team and their project is proven if it's been around this long and it's done well this long. The team is very good with Zcash, very, very good team. Um, large, pretty large team, which I like to see. Uh, small teams just don't always make sense for me. You have three people developing a massive blockchain. Doesn't ever make sense for me, but this t Zcash is completely opposite. Um, the tech is very good. Now, it is a decentralized and open source cryptocurrency that provides strong privacy protections. Shielded transactions hide the sender, recipient, and value on the blockchain. If Bitcoin is like HTTP for money, Zcash is HTTPS, a secure transport layer. So, um, they are saying that their, their zero proof technology allows fully encrypted transactions to be confirmed as valid. This new property will enable entire new classes of blockchain applications to be, to be built, right? Um, um, basically, it also it shields coins from their history on the blockchain, okay? So they're still on the public blockchain, but it's just a layer. It's a private layer, so no one can see where you're sending it, and no one can see how much you have balances and stuff and how much you're sending. 
uh, which would be a really good thing as some businesses and or people even individuals don't want their transactions to be public they want them to be private so in the pre-digital currency where both individuals and enterprises could justifiably assume that their financial transactions will be kept confidential with zcash users can enjoy the advantages of using a public blockchain while still being sure that their private information is protected okay who's behind Zcash, scientists, advisors, engineers of Zec developed and launched the Zcash protocol. This includes all the authors of Z, um, Zero Cash protocol, most of the creators of the Zero Coin protocol, and leading researchers of ZK um, Snarks themselves. So they have a very, very good team. Uh, they've been mentioned in many things as they've been around for a while, right? It's not a new coin by any means. Everyone knows about this coin. It is the first privacy coin, um, or one of them, and yeah. So that's why Z, uh, Coinbase adding Zcash is is a possibility, but in my in my eyes, I I see probably have a ten percent of being added, ten percent chance of Zcash being added over many other coins. So, so Ethereum Classic is definitely going to be added to Coinbase. They've said that it's confirmed. However, they recently said about a month ago, the five um, Coinbase is looking into five new coins so it considers adding five new coins i'm not sure if they're meaning all of them they're going to add all of them i'm pretty sure they're just going to probably pick one or they're interested in a couple so the five digital coins include cordano basic attention coin settle lumen zcash and zero x um now out of those five i really don't see zcash um uh, getting it getting in there because uh coinbase they have a like they won't ever add Monero for the fact that it's too private. Like they like privacy coins. They don't. I mean, sorry. They don't really like privacy coins. But the fact that they showed interest in Zcash is is very interesting. <laughs> um, just because they've said in past statements that they they don't really like privacy coins. But out of the five here, I see more Stellar Lumens, maybe Cardano or Zero X. Those are my top three for getting listed. I really don't see Zcash. Um, so. I don't believe Zcash will be added to Coinbase, but that's just my opinion. You guys might see something else. Um, I think Zcash is a great coin. It's got great tech. It's proven. It's been around for a while. It's pretty simple. Like if like it's simple explanation. If you go in depth through the tech, which I did, I advise you guys do by researching more into the tech. But this was just a brief overview um, and Zcash kind of review, cryptocurrency review. Um, so yeah, it's a privacy coin, similar to the Monero, where it shields your um, privacy. No one can tell where you're sending payments, how much is in the payments, right? Um, so you can really just be private. Um, if we go over to the Zcash uh, chart here, we can see that right now it is um, a kind of overbought, but not really. Uh, the RSI 64 and one day candles. Um, MACD kind of shows a more bullish trend here because Bitcoin is being kind of more bullish right now. So Zcash is kind of a close follower of Bitcoin, obviously, especially since it's a fork on the Bitcoin protocol. Um, but yeah, so this is not really much happening right now until Bitcoin starts to make a move. We can't really see anything. The moving averages are more applied to Bitcoin. That's why I use them for um especially the 50 and 30 day ones and the 200 day ones. Um, but yeah, this is interesting because Zcash uh, is, is been around for a while and they haven't, like they've done good, right? They've done very successful, but they're not very, they don't have the best marketing, okay? They don't have the best advertisement team in my opinion. I think they can get a much better, if they can market themselves better, um, maybe even a brand changing or even logo or something um, to really kind of make them stand out more. Uh, I think that would be great for Zcash, right? Because really, to be honest, I didn't get, uh, I didn't really research about Zcash until a couple months ago um, because I really didn't even, I knew about them, but they weren't in my face. Like the, 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 um, social media communities they're decent size obviously since they've been around for a while and people believe them believe in the coin and love the coin but uh when a lot of new people were coming in zcash wasn't obviously the first option um after bitcoin right i think that has to do with marketing a lot 
um, and just being active on social media and other stuff because I'm for like I know it sounds crazy but that is actually important right that's an important uh, part of cryptocurrency having a successful cryptocurrency is marketing is uh, growing a good social media presence being active being engaged with your community uh, releasing news about the coin uh, partnerships all kinds of that stuff will help the coin grow and I mean Zcash you know, by no means is not is awful at that but they're not great and if they're great I, I think we could see definitely a positive um, positive move in the price so yeah that is Zcash guys or ZEC or Zec um, right now we're just waiting to see what Bitcoin does it did have a nice little upsurge from 170 75 bucks around beginning of July, but it had a nice nice gain all the way to where it is now because of that Rumor just the rumor of it being added to coinbase now guys if it is added to coinbase Like like Bitcoin cash went up 300% in a day for Zcash. I would see more 100% uh, Maybe less than that in a day easy like coinbase is so powerful so many people use it They only have four coins on the now anytime a new coin gets at it. It goes massive just like ETC or Ethereum Classic will. So yes, if it gets added to Coinbase, I'm seeing a top 15, top 10 Zcash by the end of the year. And my price prediction for Zcash uh, with getting added to Coinbase would definitely be like $2,000 by the end of 2018 or $1,500 by the end of 2018 if it gets listed to Coinbase. If not, it could still do that price depending on how the market moves with Bitcoin, if it's going to be bullish, if the ETF's coming. There's a lot of dependence, but on a safe approach, I'm just going to say $1,000 by the end of 2018, no matter what, because uh, really that's only a 5x from now. I feel like that's possible. Um, that may be a bit optimistic, maybe $800 easy by the end of 2018. Uh, but yeah, that is my opinion, guys. Please comment below what you think of Zcash. You think it's a good coin? Do you think it's going to the moon? Do you think it'll be added to Coinbase? What do you think of Zcash? Because I'm interested in knowing what you guys think. Um, so let's start a discussion. Please comment below what you think. Um, and yeah, follow my social medias. Like the video if you do like it. Subscribe to my channel. Turn on those post notifications. And also, guys, if you do want to pick up some crypto on Coinbase, there'll be a link in the description for Coinbase, and that will get you $10 in crypto for free. So pretty good deal if you want $10 for free. If you don't, don't take the $10. But yeah, so thank you guys so, so much for watching. I do want to say that this video and none of my videos are financial advice. They're just me sharing my opinion and even investments with you guys, right? So yeah, I hope you all have a great day and peace.